Bishop E. Bishop E. Bishop Talk. Yo, sit in my element at my home and we have some piece of meat. Well, you niggas and nobody else can disturb me or ruin my brain. I'm gonna let you do his own thing. Yo, this your boy Bishop B. This Bishop Talk. I'm here with Famous Ocean. Famous Ocean, I want you to give a little glimpse about yourself. Tell the world about you. Okay. Well, my name is Famous Ocean. I'm an artist. I'm not a rapper. I'm an artist. Period. Get that straight. But anyways, I like to rap. Um, everything. You know, I just spit bars. It's all about spitting bars. It's all about getting up there. Feeling this? Chilling with the gang. I feel fantastic. I am the realest bitch. Don't ever pretend I get real active. Why am I with this? You wanna hold that? My flow so nasty. You said you spit bars. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So how long have you been rapping? I've been rapping since I was like six or seven. Okay, six or seven? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And, you know, I, I ain't gonna lie. You know, it's crazy. I went on your Instagram the other day, and I said, dang, this girl has a lot of Instagram followers. <laughs> like, how did you how did you get so many followers? Like, like, Well, I started off with freestyling, like making different freestyles, and then as I started building my rapping skills up, my freestyles started going viral and viral. So mm -hmm. that's when all my friends started and supporters started to come and all that. Oh, okay, okay. So who was like your major influence, like a uh, female wise, like to in inspire you to keep doing what you're doing? My mom. My mom is my biggest influencer. She keeps me going up and up. Like she influenced me to go better and get better. Before before we did this interview, you know, I spoke to your mom for a second and she said, um, you put a post up over her the other day and like her father just went up again, like Oh yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's how you do. Yeah. That's how you do. My supporters are real. Yeah, they're real. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, okay. And how old are you again? Sixteen. Sixteen? Yes. When's your birthday? October eighth. October eighth. Oh, okay. So tell the world, you know, um, just a little bit about what led up to you getting into music like you know what i mean like what, what made you just say you want to just start rapping and doing what you're doing well my sister and i we rap we both rap together so like me just like being bored out of boredness out of like seeing other people rapping like just getting that stuff up there i'm like i think i want to rap like mm -hmm. it's like my mom influenced me like, yeah i'm like i think i want to rap I, want, I think i want to start rapping or whatever so this one i made my first little freestyle when i was like five years old yeah kept going from then so you have how, how long did you actually have your instagram I had my Instagram, it was like since 2014, I think. 2014. 2012, yeah. And you have, and how many followers you have now? 600,000 something. Well, 600,000. 600,000. Mm -hmm. And, you know, while you have a lot of followers, I know you probably get all type of weird DMs and stuff like that. Yes. Has any celebrities reached out to you? No, not really, not no. Not no, no celebrities, celebrities, anything? Yeah. Okay, and you say you're 16, so I know this. I know this question probably will come up, but um, you have. Are you seeing a, a guy? Can I see a, a dude on your Instagram? You know, I, that's yes. your boyfriend. Yes, yeah, Chris going crazy. Chris going crazy. Yeah. Okay, tell me about. Tell me about. You know, what I mean, you and Chris go crazy. Like y'all do music together. Like. I mean, he dance, but I rap. But I dance for so, like my fans love to see me dance. So, like, but I don't dance. That's something I won't get on stage and do. Mm -hmm. But that's something I will do with him, like dance and stuff. And, like we both would dance and collab with each other. And that's what all our supporters love to see. The dancing. Yeah, mm -hmm. cause I seen you do like the music videos yeah. and stuff. I see my little cousin, she's into that too. Mm -hmm. Like the music videos. The dust smashes and all that. The dust smashes and stuff. So I also hear you're a, a young entrepreneur. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, my little cousin, you know, I one day I was just chilling and I seen him putting his little lip gloss on and it came from you. Oh, you talking about the lip drip? That's lip it. drip by the Hollywood Dolls? Let me see. You sit right here. And you're 16 years old? Yes. How does it feel to be a young entrepreneur? I mean, it feels good, it feels great, like, to not work behind nobody else, to not build off what somebody's telling you to do. Mm -hmm. Like, you just want to build up by yourself, like, build up with your group, your team, and yeah. work hard and put in that effort. And your mom, your mom, is she, does she play a big, you know what I mean, a Yes, my mom has a big impact on this. Like, she works us and tells us we need to promote this, we need to do this, and just help us gain and do that. Look! Look! Mama gave me two options, you win or you lose Never let a nigga play you out of shit he can't do Never take care of a nigga, girl you must be a fool Never let a bitch try and knock a bitch out her shoes I had to set this record straight, cause since you confused If I entertain this beat, you gon' end on the news Only scary niggas brag about what they gon' do I keep it real sis, throw the salt on the crew If we speaking facts, baby, why not bring out the truth? I had a messy ass nigga that can't tie up his shoes I heard he riding away, just 
along the way Trying to see if he can fit in, but his shit gon' get late Had to hit up King, did that so my shit can get slayed I don't hang with these bitches, cause y'all turn out so fake And I don't brag about no nigga, we just went on a date, you heard?